Okay, running a little bit tight today, but that's okay. We're here on time. Let me just uh, check Pulse Audio, make sure that it's not screwed up. I, I noticed it was clipping pretty badly yesterday and that, that was because I, I blame Zoom. Um, it had adjusted my volume automatically because it was being so helpful. Um, Okay. So, um, yeah, la last last time, last night was not good. Um, not panicking is the goal tonight. And slow is smooth, and smooth is fast. <sighs> Um, yeah, here we go. Oh dear. Okay, so we need to figure out what illegal stuff there is. So this is a stack problem. Um, and we iterate on a line basis. So um, So, um, opens that one, squirrely that one. So, okay. Um, and in this case, s dot dot. S dot append C if S negative one um, Brackets, squirrely braces, and um, and D. Well, it'll always be in D, right? Like, that's the point. Um, um, D of that equals C does not equal C, then we we sum the points together 
Um, Okay, and then this one is that, and then we do that. Um, expected for the test case is that. Oh, um, oh, uh, else, okay, so So we skip First incorrect closing character on each corrupted line. Okay, so what's going on here? I think that the problem is Yeah, okay, so this is all good. Print W. Oh wait. So So 
the first line we skip apparently. So I'm, I'm not detecting incomplete. Um, I, I think I'm doing this wrong. Um, as soon as we get to an illegal one, actually, that should be in the else case. There we go. That was atrocious. Um, let's see here. Part two. Part one expected. Part two is Two, three, four. Okay. So here we append it. Otherwise, if it is um, D of so so then D of S. Uh, negative one. And then here, if D of S negative one does not equal C, otherwise that, okay, that's not working. Okay.
start with a total score, total score of zero. Then what am I supposed to do? This is not a good day. This is not a good day. Key error. What do you mean key error? Oh, you mean key error. Sorted. L at L over two. I don't even have that in my list. What the heck? Oh, um, I only deal with incomplete lines, right? Zero. Oh, um, that was horrendous.
Well, that's probably guaranteed that I'm going to get uh, fourth place. Um, there's there's no way that I can recover that from that. I don't even know what went wrong. Like, everything went wrong. Like, I forgot that you're supposed to skip over certain lines here. I didn't really understand what I was doing up here. Like, I, I forgot to pop from the stack. Like, it was just a disaster. I don't even know what to say. Like, this is not a hard problem. Um... Yeah, so Aiden, I don't know who he is, but he actually leaderboarded globally today, it looks like. So if we go here, um, yeah, he's now second place on the, when you sort by global. Um, and who else is there? Um, yeah, I was outside of the top 1,000 for both parts, which is a disaster. I, I can't do, keep doing that, man. So bad. Oh my gosh. Um, let's see. Uh, let's put that in there. And start deleting code <laughs> that clearly didn't actually work. Hmm. Is that actually necessary? No. It's just if it's if it's so that that's that's really the the, the key here. Like determining if it's incomplete. or invalid. So if it's invalid, then we just add it straight to answer. Um, and then let's see, otherwise we pop. Does, does, um, I was trying to see remember if s.pop works. Okay, so it does. Um uh, okay, so this is a stack problem. Um I'm using a list because I am and <laughs> it's fast enough. Let's see. So uh um we have this dictionary, which is just a mapping of like, from X, like, start to end, um, opening to closing character. Um, and then each of the closing characters has a score. So I was actually kind of confused by the problem description because it said like, That it was found twice, so I thought it was like in the line, but then I realized it's it's just because it was it appeared twice. Um, And I can get rid of that. That's not really necessary anymore. Um, penalties for that. And then D is um, Closing character. 
Okay, so this pretty simple stack problem, just put it on to the stack, keep track of what you've seen, and then on the way back, pop off the stack until you find something invalid. If it's invalid, add it to the answer. Um, if it's not invalid, it'll just it'll just run out of characters in the line and continue, so that's fine. Um, thanks for hopping into, into here, Joshua. Good to see you. Um, the part two is a little bit more difficult. Um, you have to keep track of like all the different scores for each line and find the middle one. And, and the score is, is with this fancy scoring thing that I, I think I screwed it up somehow. I don't remember what I did. No, I think it was fine. I just did it reverse. So I like totally forgot that it was a stack and use it as a list, which is not going to work. So, um, let's start deleting stuff. So if it's invalid, then we just, oh, let me, before I do this, what? Hello? Is my internet out? Okay, we're back. Um, oh, and I pressed the wrong one. Let's get that in here. Okay, so my testing, the, the tests were really nice today. So for part two though, there's a stack. This was totally useless. It doesn't actually matter. All that all that matters is that it's incomplete. Um, let's see here. Is there a way to simplify this part as well with a function? I, I want to figure out a way to simplify this as well, but I, I don't really think that there is a way. Like, I think this is probably the cleanest. Like there is, you could use the, like the index or something, but like, 
you know, that seems obnoxious. Um, so check line, line, and then let's just pull in all of this. That way then we can just return immediately. Um, Okay, and then so all we do here is um, score line line s dot append. Crap! <laughs> what did I do? Oh, right. There we go. Okay, that seems a little bit nicer because of the early return. Early returns are always, just always look nicer in code. Um, but this basically goes through each line. Um, same dictionary as far as, um, what's, what do I call it, char? Closing char. And then this is, X is basically just score. Yeah, so. Yeah, basically at the at the end of this, if, if we didn't run into something invalid, the stack will have a reversed list of what we need to like, end up like closing out. Um, Uh, I need a full left function. Oh, it's reduce, right? Reduce. Um, TC. T Wait, it's function. What's the, yeah, so total is the accumulator, C is the actual um, character, and then I want to do T times five plus score C for everything in reverse stack. Oh, that's good. Oh, it needs an initial. Um, where do I pass that in? At the end. There we go. Ooh, that's nice. That's real nice. I should do this when I know camel. Actually, no, I shouldn't. I should go to bed. It's really what I should do. Um, let's pull this down and make this a list comprehension because list comprehensions are nice.
and some something like that. But honestly, the for loop is just a little bit cleaner. Maybe I do I have access to Python three? This syntax. I don't remember if it's supported. No. Dang it. There we go. That's actually pretty reasonably elegant. Um, okay, that's that's uh, that's that's a lot cleaner. I guess I didn't commit my original code, but. It was so ugly that um, probably for the better. Oh, uh, I need to clean up all of this crap up here. <laughs> the only silver lining tonight was that I at least didn't screw it up. Like I didn't do any wrong submissions. Like that's that's a step up for me. Okay, none of this starter code is necessary. Pretty concise, fairly Pythonic. I mean, I don't know if Reduce is Pythonic, but it is to me. I, I think that that's part of why I like Python is that you can integrate in these functional ideas. Um, let's see other leaderboards. Um, so this leaderboard where I'm not doing well, I'm a full 16 points back, which is pretty irrecoverable. Um, luckily, I'm I'm fairly far ahead of of the challengers, so that's good. What did I get? Seventh, seventh. Oh wow, this is really interesting. Yeah, so nobody actually gained a place, except, and so this is actually probably okay, like, this is not the worst day ever, like, I could have been way worse. Like, I lost 10 points to Kelly, but, like, considering that I get 7-7, seven, seven, that's, 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 like, bad, but it's not atrocious, I guess? I don't know, like, is this, is this better for me? At least in like, so Aiden is, where is Aiden? Aiden's way far down here. So losing points to him is actually not the end of the world because everyone lost points to him. And because Kelly beat Colin, also didn't lose too many to him. But 
And really, really what matters here is that Colin beat Ryan, which means that Ryan didn't get two extra points. So I only lost six points. Which is really interesting. Um, yeah, so bad, but not actually fatal, surprisingly. Now, second place is probably out of reach, but I'm going to, I'm going to make a pretty, I'm going to, I'm going to, I think I'll make a pretty good run at, run at third. Um... Yeah, so so earlier in chat, jo uh, Joshua mentioned, you know, I should probably not beat myself up. I, I should also probably go to bed and like actually get sleep because I didn't do that last night. I stayed up and couldn't go to sleep. So I did some work until like 3 a.m. and then got up for my 8 a.m. stand up and then like had a couple naps during the day. But that was about it. Um, okay, other leaderboards. Let's see here. So my leaderboard, which you guys can all join if you would like. Yeah, so Joshua, Kelly, me, Epsilon. Jake is solving, looks like, currently. Where's Jake on this one, anyway? Ah, down here. Uh, and then over here, looks like none of my coworkers have, have done this problem. Okay. Yeah, I mean, yeah, not not great. Um, but I can self promote, so you can go to my website. I have been writing every day. Um, uh day day nine I, I i wrote up some stuff about about it even though it was it was very painful writing this up but i th i do part of the reason why i do this write-up is so that i can learn from it because you know basically like if if I feel like if I don't learn something, then it's like totally pointless. And I, I mean, maybe all I learned here was to don't trust your past self. But that's, that's fine. You can also go to my GitHub. I'm posting all of my solutions. So this was the one that I just pushed. Um, and you can see what I've done. I'm sure there's better ways of doing every single thing that I do. But you know what? It works. And that is about it. I, I don't think there's anything else to say. And I, I kind of want to end the stream early so I can maybe, you know, get this uploaded and um, get this uh, get this done. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching. Come back tomorrow night at 10 p.m. Mountain Standard Time for, for more. Okay, bye.